Hi everyone, my name is Alison and I'm an independent stamping up demonstrator. For today's project I want to share this with you, it's a little gift bag. Uh, finished measurements are four and a half inches by one and a half by seven, which is 11 by four by 18 centimetres. So quite a nice size little bag. You could get a nice little present or quite a few little treats in there. So. It's very easy to, to make, so without any further ado, uh, let's get started. Okay, so last week I ordered and I received my new Simply Scoring board, which uh, will help make things a lot easier when making projects. Um, use this for making score lines. This has measurements across the top and down the side, which are in inches. You can also um, get a, a plate which you, you put on this um, board to adapt it with uh, metric measurements, so centimetres. So I'm sure that a bit later on I shall be purchasing that, but uh, that's a bit later. Okay, for the project today you need a piece of DSP, design series paper, that measures 12 inches by 8.5, which is 30.5 by 21.5 centimeters. Don't worry about uh, the measurements, they will all be on my blog and there'll be a link in the description box below so if you miss anything just pop over and uh, all the details will be there. Okay so on the short side you need to score at, I'll try and get this right this time, this is now the third time I've, I've attempted this video because I keep getting the measurements wrong so okay so at one and a half inches. Turn the paper, so the long side's at the top, and then you need to score at one and a half, five and three quarters, seven and a quarter, and eleven and a half. You have to be a bit careful when you're using designer series paper not to press too hard, otherwise you you could go straight through. So that's the score lines done. A bit difficult to see, but okay, so now you don't need that anymore. Put that out of the way. Okay, now next thing you need to burnish our score lines. So using the burn folder. Okay, so you have a, a narrow section at the bottom, which is for the base, and then there is a square rectangle, square rectangle, and a little rectangle in the right hand corner. The small rectangle we don't need, so you can, using a pair of scissors, cut that away. And then you need to cut up the score lines up to the first or the horizontal score line. And on the side, the narrow rectangle, which runs all along the side, if you just cut a small wedge off the, each end, this helps when you put the box or the bag together. It gives it a neater finish. Okay, I'm going to use tear and tape. You can use um, whatever adhesive you like, um, liquid glue or... or any other adhesive? This one works very well. Okay. 
the tear and tape along the narrow rectangle or tab at the end. So you look where the where the seam is, which is here. So that's going to be the back of our bag. So you need to fold in the two sides, fold in the back, and then that's the, the front. So again with some tear and tape. Again, depending on what you're going to put inside the box, you may want to put a bit more tape on the bottom. I'm just going to put one strip. And then what you need to do at the sides with your finger, you push in at the middle and the the sides and the top will naturally come together. And again, depending on, on what you, you put in the box, depends how far up the, the fold will go. So there you go. Now I'm going to put some ribbon across the top. I find it easier just to, I've got some little clips, just clip that, the top closed. I'm going to take some ribbon. I still haven't bought any of the matching stamping up ribbon yet, so I'm just making do with what I've got. So I'm going to attempt to tie a bow, which is not my strong point, but. There's the, the box with the bow. Now I'm going to stamp the, the label. I've got bits of uh, Whisper White cardstock. This is uh, Night of Navy ink. Using the this is my um, label me lovely punch. I'm going to punch another one. This is Knight of Navy cardstock, so it matches the ink. It also matches. The blue in the paper is Knight of Navy also. <clears throat> Adhesive. And I'm just going to offset the two labels. Like 
next one. I'm going to take some, these are metallic pearl embellishments. Of the place. That one. The feet. The third one. And then I'm going to take some mini dimensionals. This one. Take the backings off. there and there you go simple little gift box bag I'm sure anybody would quite be very pleased to receive a, a little gift in the bag which you've made comes in so there you go uh, English version and a French version I hope you enjoyed the video I hope that you are inspired to have a go if you want any further information there's links to my blog or my stamping up um, site in the description box below why not uh, subscribe to my my chain or give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video until next time hope you enjoyed it see you again soon bye